Hi, thanks for joining us today. This is Eric with Daytona Homes. Uh, today we're gonna talk about sump maintenance and the time of year you're gonna wanna look at that is before the spring melt. So come on over to the corner here. Start off, you're gonna have to remove four screws. I've already gone ahead and removed three of them. We're gonna remove the last one here. Also, you'll find on yours, you'll actually have a rubber plug in place of the hole here. This you'll have to remove first to be able to get the lid out of the way. Then we can have a look inside. Now that we're at the sump location, um, I can tell you that it is designed to pump water from inside the barrel out of the home to keep your basement dry. Before we go inside the barrel and we actually test the unit, we wanna make sure that everything is clear of obstructions. So all of your cables should be wrapped up above the lid. We wanna ensure that it's plugged in correctly. We have two plugs here. First, we have the sump plug, and we have the float plug. These should be attached together and then plugged into the wall. So when we go inside, there's a couple things we're gonna look for. We wanna make sure that any debris that could have fallen in from the last year uh, or any sand or sediment can be cleaned out at this point. We wanna make sure those cables are free and clear of the sump. And we actually wanna reach down, grab the sump, We'll lift it up and you should hear a humming sound when you let go of that float it should stop this is the natural operation of the sump as the water level rises and drops now that we've talked about sump maintenance down in the basement there are a couple items to take a look at on the outside to avoid unnecessary load on the sump pump on the exterior corners of the home, you should have downspout extensions or a rainwater leader. Downspout extensions do need to be laid flat on the grade to channel the water away. Rainwater leaders are already equipped um, and tied into the storm system, so you don't need to do anything there. Thank you for joining us here today to review sump maintenance. If you need any more information on that, please review the Daytona Homes Homeowner Guide. Thank you.